Hi folks. Uh, the purpose of this video is to help demonstrate how to avoid or overcome the problem of dogs who want to see the food in our hand before they do the trick. Um, but a good way to avoid it early on, right from the beginning is, is when we lure the dog into the behavior with the food, we then feed with a different piece of food out of our other hand. And that might look like this. This is my dog, Rudy. And I might say, Rudy, sit. Good dog. And then I feed him from my other hand. And he quickly learns, stand. Good dog. That the food in this hand isn't necessarily what he's going to get, and so he doesn't need to see it. This is also how we overcome the problem if we're already stuck on that step. And so I'm going to do it a couple little behaviors here for you. Rudy, down. Good dog. Very quickly after a few of these, Rudy, settle. Good dog. We should be able to get to the point where we no longer need to use the food as the lure at all. Um, like this. Rudy, sit. Good dog. Now my hands are empty. Rudy, down. Good dog. And early on when we're overcoming that problem, go ahead and reward the food from the other hand still, but soon we'll get to the point where we don't need the food in our hands. And in fact, the dog will do the behavior without the food at all. However, I still recommend using food as a reward regularly and often, even though we do want to do, we do want to get to the point where we're on any given session, we don't have to have it. Any given situation, we don't have to have it to get the behavior. That comes from practice with good form, like I just showed you. Um, but whereas it used to really definitely be my goal and most people's goal to not have to use the food at all, what I've learned, and I think more and more people are moving to this place, is the food does more than just teach the dog or reinforce the behavior. It also helps our relationship so much to have that really powerful and solid reinforcer as we do our work together. And then, like I said, at any given time, we don't have to have the food but we keep using it again and again while we practice, and it really helps support our bond and our relationship, and keeps the whole process of us asking for things and then doing things super fun and super, super positive. All right, thanks a lot for listening. Good job.